Maglev trains come in various speeds and low and medium speed maglev trains are deemed more suitable for urban areas similar to subways or light rails. China's first domestically made low and medium speed maglev trains are now undergoing test run operations. Let's take a close look. This is China's newest maglev train. The test runs began in Tangshan in Hubei province on June 15th, about one week ago. The train has three carriages, and each carriage has between 100 and 120 seats. Maglev trains float on a magnetic field and are propelled by a linear induction motor. There are no wheels running along a track, so there is no wheel noise. Just like this newest maglev train shown here, its working noise can hardly be heard five meters away. The maglev train has a design speed of up to 120 kilometers per hour. That's faster than light rail trains, which can attain speeds of up to 80 kilometers per hour. The maglev train also has stronger power going uphill and turning corners. The maglev train will offer more convenience and faster service for urban transport. Vehicle power supplies are located inside the train carriages. Even if there is a sudden loss of electricity, these power supplies can help the maglev train keep on running to a safe area before gradually stopping. Engineers say there will be little electromagnetic radiation created when the power generating machine is running. Compared with the radiation from television and electric shavers, the electromagnetic radiation from the maglev train is minimal. Currently, Japan has the most mature technology on low and medium speed maglev train development. But successful test runs on China's newly developed maglev trains show that China will be also able to mass produce this technology. David Rathbun, CCTV.